footsteps. He was thus given the nickname Master Ao. He was very happy to introduce me to Tainan's famous snacks. Ao explained that usually some of Tainan's best foods can be found in the night markets or on the streets. As history goes, most people didn't have the luxury to sit down and eat expensive foods. And over the years, street food became the staple meal. Mmm! Mm. These are called coffin breads. Mm, excuse me. I think of it as um, kind of like the Boston bread bowls. They're really, really good. Mm. 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 Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。
traditional wedding feasts got their name Bando because of the fact that chefs directly moved the kitchen, all of the food, and dining tables out into the middle of the streets. To me, the idea of having everybody eating out in the streets is a very fun way to celebrate. Quite befitting of Tainan's spirit. <laughs> Lobster. It's a tough job running around in over 35 degree heat, making sure you're making all the guests happy. Even though Ao grew up in Tainan, even he can't always stand the heat. I'm exhausted. I'm hungry. I'm watching everybody eat. It's time for me to eat now. better way to celebrate my first visit to Tainan. I'm surrounded by new friends and stuffed with the best food. The hospitality of the people here make me and Atoga feel right at home, making true the statement, in the neighborhood of Texas, and I'm gonna have Wahoo be my ship. And y'all are all invited. See you next time.